it's your girl the mac of all trades and i'm back with another dollar tree haul yes another dollar tree haul i can't wait to show you all what i picked up i got some goodies so let's just go ahead and get right into this dollar tree haul and i'll show you all what i picked up so first things first i picked up this really really cute in this cute welcome sign for saint patrick's day and i love how it's like the distressed look but with the galvanized um <clears throat> with the galvanized shamrock right here where the o would be like i think that is so stinking cute so had to get that up here and then i also picked up this is 10 piece and there are 10 fortunes in here they're little like foam sorry about the ring light foam fortune cookies and i thought they were so stinking cute so i'm gonna put these in the kids's valentine's day gifts because i think that is just too cute then i also picked up this really 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 pretty jar and it's a big jar and i like the lid and i'm gonna put conversation hearts the little candies in here and then tie a little um valentine's day ribbon on there and have it just setting out it's gonna be so cute then i picked up this little um candy um heart or whatever there's little pieces of chocolate in there and it says be a mermaid and make waves this is for trinity's valentine's day gift then i picked up um this no touch key there's actually another one too but it's in the other bag um this is a no touch key so keep the distance between your hands and dirty surfaces on how to you can use it to like open doors and stuff but i got this for carissa cause she was like saying how she wanted one and so i got her this one and i got her another one as well but this one's like a dark blue with little flowers on it and i got these felt hearts and they had them in they had them in white red and pink but i only got the red and the white because i'm i want to do a diy with these but I need to try to find the like burlap banner that I've seen other YouTubers talking about in the like party section. It's just plain burlap banner, but I haven't been able to locate it. Hopefully I'll be able to so I can make this little craft with these. But uh, there are 12 in each package and they're just those felt hearts. Then I picked up a couple of these 100 grand um, candy bars for my sister from another mister. That's her favorite candy. So I, I'm just going to give her those. And then I, um, I absolutely love their cotton rounds. And so I was running low. And so I picked up another pack of these and there are 80 in there. Then I picked up another pack of the cherry jelly hearts. I see you, Dina. She got some of these too. Uh, these candy jelly hearts, cherry, I mean, jelly hearts, because I absolutely love them. And, um, I already ate one whole bag myself. So I had to get another one. And then I picked up a package of the Tiny Conversation Hearts by Brox. And this is a, how big is this? Five ounce bag. And I'm just going to be putting them in here. I already have some upstairs. Like a big bag that um, my daughter bought from Target. But I'm going to put those in with it. So it fills it up. And then you guys. Okay, so I saw another YouTuber um, showing these masks off. And I'm like, girl, why did you not get those? Because that is a name brand product. This is not a Dollar Tree product. It's by the brand OK. OK, so OK, see that? These are not Dollar Tree products. They sell this brand at Ulta. They sell it at Walgreens, I think. They sell it at CVS. But this is a really good brand. So if you see these, pick these up. Definitely worth the dollar. So these are the three-step blackhead clearing nose pore strips. So I'm going to be putting these because they're pink. So I'm going to be putting, I got three of them, and I'm going to be putting them in with Valentine's Day stuff, right? Because my daughter loves the nose pore strips. Um, so I'm going to be gifting her one of those. And then I found some really good books, you guys. Um, this is kind of going to be all over the place because of the way I'm going through the bags. But this is a curate your life, Insta style, create stunning photos, elevate your Instagram influence. I thought this was just a cute book. This is a good like coffee table book, but look, it's from Target. 
And this was originally $19.99, but we getting it for a dollar. You know how I am about the books there. I be loving the books. Okay, and so then I got this. This is Wise Cocktails, the Owl's Brew Guide to Crafting and Brewing Tea-Based Beverages, including Marguerite Tea, T-E-A, the Speakeasy Special, Shine, Rise and Shine, Jenny Rips, and Maria, Maria Littlefield. But this is just like a cocktail book. It's going to look so cute on my bar cart. I'm not sure what the MSRP is on this. Let's try to peel this sticker back so we can see what the MSRP is. Because you know how I like to help. No. Okay. So, yeah. This book was originally $19.99. But we get it for a dollar. It's going to be so cute on my bar cart because of the like whole chalkboard look to it. It's totally my house aesthetic so it's gonna look perfect on there then i picked up this other um alcohol influence book but this is the hugh johnson's pocket wine book 2019 i don't care what date it is it's gonna look cute on my bar cart and this was originally 16.99 but we getting it for a dollar but yeah it's just a bunch of wines it's just a decorative piece and i'm going to be taking the sleeve off of it so it can be or maybe I will leave the sleeve on because I don't like that pinky red color but if I wanted to I could take the sleeve off then um I also picked up this cookbook this is cook in the blank the fun freewheeling game plan that takes you from zero to dinner this looks really really fun so play this game plan your dinner what's for dinner cook in the blank is a no fuss all fun way to answer that question 20 fill in the blank recipe templates spark creativity and nudge out your nudge you out of out of ruts paving the way for endlessly riffable favorites from enchiladas to frittatas to sheet pan chicken but doesn't this book look fun like i thought this was gonna be fun because i'm i'm seriously like like lasagna, okay. But like you fill in the blank. <laughs> like this sounds really, really neat. Oh, I'm still at lasagna. So fried blank with, so look, it's like fried and you choose a rice or grain. Okay, and then you do a veggie and then a protein. So like then on the backs of the pieces of paper it gives you like hints of different things you could choose to fill in those blanks so i thought this would be a really 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 fun kind of cookbook and the blue of it will go with um my you know aesthetic in my kitchen sorry it will go with my aesthetic in my kitchen but this was originally 17.99 but we got it for a dollar Yes, I picked up this super size solving colossal word puzzle, giant poster, fun with friends, biggest crossword ever, volume one. But this is like a huge ass crossword puzzle. I figured Carissa would have a blast with this because you know, she's little Miss Smarty Pants. She loves stuff like this. So she's going to have a lot of fun with this. I can't decide if I just want to gift it to her now or if I want to like save it. For Valentine's Day, I think I'll just give it to her. Or I could save it for her Easter basket. I think I'll save it for her Easter basket. Another set of books that I was hoping, hoping, hoping that I would find. And there was only one there. And I was like, oh my god, it was meant to be. Okay, so this is... Who is this? I can't read that cursive. Something's Liquor Bar. Schiller's? Something like that. We're going to open it. Because these are just too cool. So this book set is originally $19.95. But we get it for a dollar. But this is also a liquor bar book. So I saw someone else hauling these. And I was like, oh my god, I have to get them. But look, you guys. So each one is like different. Bartender's Guide. Seasonal Drinks. Artisanal Updates. 
classic cocktails. This is going to look perfect on my bar cart, you guys. I absolutely love it. It is so cute. I can't wait to put these on my bar cart. Because, you know, it don't matter if I ever look in here and figure out how to make any of these cocktails in here. And Oh, and this part's raised, too. It don't matter. It was only a dollar. So, why not? So, yeah. I got that. Okay, and then I got these little moss bunnies. There's three in a pack. I know they're going to be hard to see. But there's like three little moss bunnies in there. I also picked up some Easter little... They're calling them Easter eggs. But to me, they're just so freaking cute. Look, so this is a three pack of little baby chicks. And there's three in there. These are going to be so cute. So I'm going to fill them with little candies and put them in the kids' Easter basket. And then here's three of the little carrots. So these are just going to be so, so, so cute. And then I picked up these. These are six little decor carrots. I got two packs. And these I thought would look really cute um, if I figured out a way to hang them from my pencil tree because I do have a pencil tree. It's like a little Christmas tree that's up all year that I decorate for the seasons or holidays or whatever. So I thought these would look really, really cute on there. Then I also picked up another pack of the LED um, heart-shaped string lights because I gave the other two packs that I um, had hauled to Carissa and Trinity for them to decorate with for the room for valentine's day and i was like i need a pack for my um coffee bar you know what i mean so i had to get another one okay and then here's that other no touch key and this one looks like marble so i thought that was really cute and then you guys they had different kinds of these but this was the only kind that fit my aesthetic but this is a um hanging lid that you would put on like a mason jar can you believe that? And it has a star in there cut out in the top. So that's so cute. So cute. And then um, I also picked up two different magnets. I've never really paid attention to the magnets, but um, for some reason these ones caught my eye. So I really like this one and it just says wash your hands. And I get this one. My favorite breed is rescue because yes, all of our dogs are rescue dogs. So Okay, and then um, also I found this little sign. Now, I don't particularly care for the color of it or whatever, so I might recraft it, but this is a heavy, solid piece of wood, you guys. This is not no balsa wood or it's not hollow. It's completely solid, and it says together is my favorite place to be, but you guys, this is like... You hear that? It's solid. Okay, and then I also picked up six of these bins. These are just too cute. Um, I'm hoping I can find more sizes of these too, of like this color and the style with um, to match all together. But I'm hoping that these will fit in my coat closet because I really need to do some organizing in there and I want it to be all like super matching because it is a coat closet and it does get used so I want it to look really nice and so these are like really strong and durable and I want I almost feel like they could stack like on top of each other you know what I mean like yeah so they could stack like that I mean it looks kind of funky but I don't know which other way you would stack them. Yeah, you could stack them like that, but that's what it would look like. So not too bad, I guess. But um, anyway, I picked up six of these because I'm going to be, and I'll take you all along for that organizing journey as well. I was also able to find these little clay pots. So I got these come two. To a pack and then these ones come three to a pack but i figured these would be really cute for little diys or something like that like faux plants because you guys real plants i'll kill them and also they had these really really cute valentine's day bags and there's three to a pack so you get that one then that one and then that one and I figured these would be cute for Valentine's Day to use for gifting 
So I got those. Then I also found these little cute decors and they come two to a pack. I thought they were one to a pack, one like a dollar each, but there's two of them in here. Cause I really like this one. That's the one I wanted. And I was like, oh, okay, bonus. You get this one. So I'll let the girls use that one to decorate the room. But it says, I picked you. And then this one says, all you need is love. All you need is love. Okay. And then I also picked up, let's see, this is 20 um, zipper seal storage bags. And these are like the quart size, I want to say, or something like that. I'm not sure. But I got them. Okay. Also, then while I was in the checkout line, these caught my attention for the girls' room. So these are string lights. There's 10 on here, but these ones are little planets. And then these ones are little shooting stars. I thought these would be so stinking cute. Then I also picked up this lip scrubber for doing lip scrubs. I should have got more of these and put them with those other lip scrubs. Remember those other lip scrubs that I hauled? And put these with it for the Valentine's Day things. I keep pointing over there because that's where I have all this stuff. But yeah, I should have done that. Okay. Didn't have to do that. Okay. And then also I got this floral foam. This is just a 2.4 inch by 2.9 inch by... 7.8 inch because I'm going to need that. I've been doing a lot of floral arrangements lately because I'm transitioning my house from Christmas. I took down all the Christmas in most everywhere except for the kids' bathroom and then down in the office slash den. Those still have Christmas stuff, but um, I've already transitioned everything else everywhere else in the house over and so I'm slowly working on that. Well, it's not slowly, it's coming along, but it just takes time. You know what I mean? And it's a lot of like moving things from one place to another, to another, to another. Okay. Anyway, so also they have these stones. This is 32 ounces and they're just little black stones. I love using these in candle jars. I plan on using them in these pots to do faux floral arrangements. And I also got these ones. So like the river stones package to to do that with because I figured oh that'd be really cute and just stick those in there that is going to conclude this Dollar Tree haul I hope you all enjoyed it um keep a lookout for those okay masks okay because those are a bomb ass deal and also check the books because you know how I love the books okay so yeah that is going to conclude this Dollar Tree haul I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I upload a new video. And with all that being said, thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. You can be notified whenever I upload a new video. Chewy is over here eating faux floral. He's like, he's not like eating it. He's just like gnawing on it. Like he thinks it's a stick from outside. Because there's some right there. Oh my God, he's so chewy. Okay, so. With all that being said, Chewy, stop.